Alright. Um we managed to get the seats out and the carpet out. And there's some shady patchwork that was done on, on the car. Let me show you. Look at this. They put this metal sheet metal. It looks like duct work. Okay. They put that in here and just screwed it down and then seam sealed it. They did it there. They did it over there in the passenger floor. So now that I see the pans, there's holes there. Holes right there. The tow boards got holes in them. And that's all busted up, rusted out. So what I'm going to have to end up doing is I'm going to go ahead and order full length four, four pan for that side and this side. And we get tow board patch panels, tow board patch panels, and the new rear seat panels. So four different panels or six different panels that I'll be putting in this car. So that just delays me about two weeks worth of work because I'm, I'm working full time so that's where I'm at on this now the carpet is out of here seats are out so I gotta get to work on the four pans so I'll order those get those here and then we'll do some floor pan installation videos but that's where I'm at on this car so still got the tail pan I got this piece in I already mentioned that that piece is already in so i gotta replace this do some work here on the tank trunk drop offs uh <clears throat> for complete four i'm gonna what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna do the, the you know the full length pans here i'm not gonna buy the full four pan uh because they're out of stock right now so and i'm gonna say i'm gonna use I'm going to keep this tunnel here, and I'll just weld to it. So that'll be coming up shortly on these videos, but I just want to give you a quick update on the 65's condition and the shady sheet metal work that they did. You can see it there. Let's walk around to the other side of the car. We had a rainstorm last night. Uh, right here. See that? All they did was just screw some sheet metal down on top. So, that's the crap I gotta deal with. Alright, thanks for watching. Like, share, subscribe. Peace out.